What? I'm Johnny Stuna with the rest of the news. Good evening. I think when I'm done here, I'm going to hang out on social media. I'm going to loiter hours, many hours, maybe until morning when the action news team comes in all bubbly, holding their lattes, all full of BS. I hate the action news team. I'm here doing the rest of the news, which it's not very good. What does this say? Does loitering apply to social media? Did you write that? Well, we're stretching the definition of loitering, but I say yes, social media is a form of loitering. Now, if you're on social media and you're hanging out and checking out your friends' posts and pictures and liking and commenting, that's okay. But after a couple of minutes of that, it's time to move along. Time to move along, as the cops say. Nothing to see here. Time to move along. Do something productive. But there doesn't seem to be a lot of moving along. From social media to Congress. Congress. What are they doing? What are they doing there? To the big city street life. Loitering is commonplace. See, I'm forgetting what I'm saying here, so just bear with me. On the way to your coffee shop, you may see the same people every day sleeping there. There's no moving along with them because they've got nowhere to go. The street is their bed. The curb is their pillow. And that can't be too comfortable. And you can't be in the right state of mind to think it's normal. Whether you're the one sleeping in the street or you're visiting from Bangor, Maine. It's unacceptable. It is. What are we doing about it? What? No, I'm gonna to try to hang on script here. Oh, here we go. Here in San Francisco, <clears throat> we have a affordable housing crisis. Affordable housing that now the social media companies, those folks that caused the affordable housing crisis, now want to try to fix it. And you wonder, where do the homeless fit in? Because I don't really see them fitting in. And what does this affordable housing really mean? Is it really ridiculous housing? aim for the employees that work for these social media companies that encourage the loitering, the hanging out, the commenting, the, the liking, the reposting, the retweeting, the repeating, the repeating, and the hanging out. What? I just got a little bit here. Okay, one more bit. Either you're for homelessness or you're against homelessness. I know what you're saying. You're saying, Johnny Stunad, how could anybody in the right frame of mind be for homelessness? How could you look at people sleeping in the streets and think it's normal? How could you call that good? Well, we may be all part of the problem. Otherwise, that person you stepped over to get into the coffee shop so you could loiter on social media, he won't be there tomorrow and he won't be there the next day. Can social media companies help solve this homelessness problem? Maybe. They're smart. They got a lot of money. They got a lot of money. But there's more money in people hanging out than getting people off the street. I'm Johnny Stunad with the rest of the news.